Right everybody, it's been a year. This is the time where we reflect on 2019 and everything that it was. I sat here, or well, basically a year ago in the dressing gown and I shared with you all at the start of this channel, basically that starting wasn't easy. Everybody says, oh, just start, just start. It's so easy. And uh, the thing for me that it wasn't easy was because that when I commit to something that I truly want to achieve and truly do well at, I basically say to myself that quitting is not an option. So when you're willing to commit to something and basically you can't quit. You have no choice but to carry on. So you better be ready because everything you face, there's no option to quit. You've got to carry on. And this may be cliche, but that's the thing that when quitting isn't an option, you're forced to be strong. And I set myself seven big goals to achieve and they did eventually diminish to six. And I will be updating that list. And unfortunately, everybody, well, I didn't actually achieve any of those in 2019. And that's totally fine because they were big, big goals and I didn't expect to achieve them within the time of a year. It was actually because of starting this YouTube channel that I was able to come up with the list because I suddenly realised that if my channel is documenting my journey to making my dreams a reality, if I haven't really properly laid out my dream, who's going to care about me if I say, oh, I would just like an average bit of success on YouTube, I'm not sure what, or when I might do something in TV. Nobody's going to care and follow that journey. And I thought, I really need to get specific to myself and to my audience about what I'm trying to achieve. And so that's been one of the best things about this channel is that it's forced me to get very specific with the goals and that is what this channel is it is documenting the process of me chasing my dreams and that's when I came up with one of my quotes one of my many many quotes that nobody cares about a journey unless the destination is clear so let's reflect together on some of the best videos of 2019 right starting off with my top viewed video I connected a Sega to a flat screen TV <laughs> I shared the footage of me and Big Brother with some context Are you in the igloo? What's this like? Sam? You know, I'm staying here. Me too. Are we gonna live here like... Oh yeah! Totally! The Eskimos would be jealous I when they see this. I... I joined the world of online dating. It's not very good. I decided that TV auditions just weren't for me until I build leverage and brand on my YouTube channel and prove myself. I realised that the secret to not being afraid to fail is to commit to something for the long term because then all those failures seem small. Sylvester Stallone, Rocky Balboa, hey, he liked my comment on his Instagram post. If I'm clever enough in editing, I'll put a screenshot there. That means a lot to me. Like, right, Rocky, one of my main inspirations. Hey, da da da. Coming to the conclusion that a relationship isn't there to make me happy or to complete me, it's there simply to compliment me. And that's compliment with an E. And that mindset allowed me to look at relationships in a much healthier way. And a lot of my sort of longing for one was actually based out of insecurity. And now that I've recognized that, it's opened the doors to many wonderful things. I shared my story of the girl who changed my life. This is the thing that I'll never forget. She looked at me and she said to me, Zach, one day I think you're gonna be famous. And she wasn't joking. She was sort of dead serious to me and there was not, not many other people around and she said that to me pretty much by herself and I said, well it took me by surprise because we hardly just met and I obviously was giving off this amazing aura but she said that to me and I just replied with something dozy like, well I'm not sure what for because at the time I didn't really know, I didn't really have any specific talents, I didn't even know what I wanted to do in life. I documented my time on holiday in Italy. Whilst I was out there, I discovered the secret to confidence. Spoiler, it's practice. I filmed my first ever public video which was out there in Italy walking around the town being funny. That will always be a special moment for me because I've always imagined myself making, you know, content like that. So that's the first ever one I've done and I'm proud of it. Here's a group of people who all had a terrible experience at the opticians. And it carries on down here as well. Look at this guy, he's particularly sad about it. Jezolo is a beach resort, and as you'd expect with beach resorts, people like to make sandcastles, but here they take it to the next level. People around the world fly in to make these sculptures, and I've been flown here as well to share my artistic talent. And here's my entry, here it is. It's called Blank Slab took many hours. I got a big insect stuck in my hair because I hadn't washed it for many, many days. Quite revolting, burrowing in there. The truth about happiness 
and truly loving somebody and what it actually means and realizing that there are no shortcuts to happiness. That was a very important conclusion I came to. Finding the girl who changed my life. My friend said where she was and then everything started happening. Going back to Italy again, building a tripod out of hotel room furniture. And by the way, I'm not vlogging like this. I hate, you know I hate holding cameras because I'm, I need a crew behind me. So what I'm gonna do is try and construct some kind of tripod arrangement. Right, the light will be rubbish because it's into a window. See, I know so much about photography. But what I'm gonna do, I didn't think of this last time, I'm gonna get the table off the balcony and use it with a chair. So stay tuned. Top compelling, I nearly said television, but it isn't. Outside table, indoors. Oh, I'm so strong, this is pure concrete. No, it isn't, it's plastic. Right. Well, that's no good, this is too low. Ah, I think I know the solution. It's the stool while you're doing a stool. One second. One minuto, uno minuto. I always knew this would come in handy. Let's try this. Don't be too high, don't be too high. High's all right, because we're talking about the doors. Yes! I have a tripod on holiday, finally. And probably my favorite video of the entire channel is where I went around Burano Island in public making funny observations. That is probably my favorite video I've made so far. So if you haven't seen that, I do recommend checking that one out. Super proud of that one. Sunglasses, ga, ga, ga. I like that, I'm funny. I'm not wearing these sunglasses because of the sun. I'm actually wearing them because of the houses of Burano are so bright. Check this out, ga. Da! Da! It's another place where I'm not welcome. <laughs> Visiting Slovenia, the Postogna Caves, that was quite epic. <laughs> You've got to keep your head down. It's affecting the filming slightly. Well, like, look, here we go, look, nice chandelier there. Surprisingly low. No, it's going again. Why have they got a chandelier in the middle of it? I'm going to keep my head. I'm going to keep my head down. Oh. Coming back and interviewing people. That was a big step and a big decision on my channel. More interviews coming in 2020. That was a big thing for me. That was really the next step for me chasing my dreams and becoming this person and, you know, getting on there for late night. Wow, I don't know why that deserves a hair thing, but it does. So interviewing is being a big thing for me, just getting out there and testing, you know, can I bounce off these people? Do, do I even have what it takes to interview people? And apparently I do. Getting impatient, waiting for a number. Why did it take so long, you imbeciles? The new painting, eh -eh. Sharing my poetry with you. A strange sense of peace upon you. Where is your place in history? Assess your existence, time grinds forwards. Are you being left behind or do you move with purpose? Welcome to where your regrets live. It's always raining here. A dark haired angel in a white lace dress stands to face you. Where are you headed? A wedding or bright funeral? Her eyes cold and crystal blue. You know who I am, the girl who believed in you. The rain drains down the pain, falling faster, let the chaos rain. The tired town strains but holds, as a view of madness unfolds. Reaching the top wasn't worth the view, a bleak outlook faces you. Even though it hurts, still smile, as storms like these only last a while. I'll learn the language you'll soon see, then you'll finally be with me. Away from what I know, we'll take the time to watch our vineyard grow. A new love will mature so pure and true, my answer to life was always you. We fell in love, under the sun, in shining veneto, soon to be left cold, empty, and searching. Actually getting her number, hang on, I gotta get it out of my pocket. This is important, speed! Yes, getting her number, it is in here. Oh, the answer to everything, it's in here. Oh, from head to heart, to wherever else you wanna go, I shall know, in here. You're in here, and you're soon to be in here, and in here, gah, this, the power of tech, man. The power of tech. Getting very excited. Hello, everybody. I'm excited, too excited to set this camera up properly. I don't care about mise-en-scene. Who cares about that? I am the scene. Look, I can all the tripod's raising now. Look, 
This is exciting. I've had a reply. There's no cream on my face. There's no misery to be found. I ask and you shall receive. I've had a reply this morning from her. Gah! I am mentally stable. I promise. This is exciting. It could be happening. I'm gonna dance. I don't care. This is a this is a happy time, suckers. Oh, I'm doing a strange jig. I got a a we e e e e ply. Documenting all the emotions. Ah. <laughs> Why can't this work? Come on universe, come at me bro. I'm ready, I'm here to absorb your goodness. I've done my time man, I've gone to the mental hell. I'm ready now, I'm extracting the good of life. I'm ready to taste it man. Getting very romantic. But what I do want to say in my dressing gown is something that you probably think I'm a bit mad for saying, a bit delusional, stupid, whatever you want to think, that's fine. But I really do want to say that I actually think she's my soulmate. I said it. <laughs> there you go. I'm hoping when I look into her eyes I feel as if I've come home. You know, I'm willing to make her happiness my priority. It's, uh, it's just one of those things that I'll do. I just want to take away any pain from her life, really, any way I can, and um, replace it with love, understanding, and um, a true connection. But, um, you know, any negativity in her that stems from the past and things that might not be resolved, we'll... Uh, We'll look at them, so any negativity that passes on into the present or the future, we'll look at the problems, we'll see them for what they are, we'll find a way around them, we'll replace them with, as I said, positivity and love. And if there's any problems that we find that can't be fixed, a wrong that can't be all righted, then we'll find a way to live with it and deal with it and move forwards. And um, I'm just going to be there every step of the way and I just want to ease ease her existence really, like I said in my poem and um, you know, because I've been there myself and I just want to set her free. That basically was 2019 for Zach Ascot. I just want to say a big thank you to you, yes you, thank you so much for supporting me, it really does mean the world to me. So starting wasn't easy but I stayed committed and it got easier as I carried on. So just never forget how much I truly appreciate you and your time to you know, put energy into me and you're really helping my dreams become a reality and I can't wait to share this journey with you and I also hope along the way of my journey actually inspires you to go after what you want and follow what feels right to you. So I'm always here to chat in the comments if you want me and I do have a genuine interest in you and your potential and everything else and I think you can do it. You just can. Even if you don't know what it is, you can do it. So I'm going to say goodbye now and thank you so much and we've got a great 2020 ahead of us and here's the gown going out now. Maybe I'll be wearing, who knows what I'll be wearing next time. Wah. Have a close up shot of the glorious material. That could be the end screen actually. Oh yes, that's so clever. That's the end screen now. The There you go. Thanks for watching on that. Oh, I could do that in future. Genius.